What's up, guys? It's Hidden Pants here, and today we are playing as Fizz in the mid game. Mid game. Mid lane. Wow, I, I can't speak. But anyway, I'm gonna pick up boots, three health potions, and. Whoops. <laughs> three health potions, a mana potion, and my warning trinket, and I'm gonna head over to mid. Um, and I am up against a Kale this game. Kale, Kaylee, however you're supposed to pronounce it. I know a lot of people don't really know, but. It. K Kaylee, Kale, whoever it is, is a girl, so I would guess it's Kaylee, personally, but th that might just be the Firefly fan in me talking. Uh, but anyway, uh, I'm not, I don't really think I'm going to be able to leash for uh, Hecarim very well, but I'm going to try anyway, because I'm a nice guy. Um, but the way this matchup w is probably going to work until level 2 at least, until I get some mobility, is... Kaylee's just going to have her Righteous Fury, and she's just going to be bullying me to hell with it. Because it'll give her attack range on me. So, yeah, it, it's not going to be a fun lane. Um, for the most part, not at least until level 3, at my guess. Um, but, anyway, I'm just going to stick my ward trinket, my trinket ward right there, and I'm going to head over here to help Leash. And I'm going to miss some CS to do this, but... I think it's going to be worth it, because I, I'm going to be wanting a... <laughs> whoops. I am going to be wanting a, um, a gank from Hecarim early, if possible. Um, because he's going to be bullying me a lot. And, well, no one likes to be bullied. So, <laughs> we'll see how this goes. And I... I was right, she did start with her Righteous Fury, and it looks like I lagged for a sec there. Um, so I'm just going to do my best to stay in XP range until um, until I hit level 2, and then I can start bullying her. Because um, I know that she can just walk up and bat me. E even at this range, she probably can just step forward a little bit and start whacking me, and, that, and that's never good. So... I just need to make sure that I'm getting the XP for these, and I should be okay. And, yep, I'll get the XP for that one. Good, good. And, yep. Oh, ooh, ooh, ow, 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 ow. See, that's exactly what I was talking about. She hit level 2 before me, too, so she was able to whack me a lot more than I had anticipated. Um, but her Righteous Fury did just go off of cooldown, so I can go over here and start bopping these minions. And I'm just going to do that, get some free damage off on her. Well, more or less free. She has a lot of minions, so that probably wasn't the greatest idea. But, what you going to do? Um, and I did take Barrier this game, because when I saw that I was up against Kale, I knew that I was going to have to bait her, because she has her ultimate. And, well, let's face it, her ultimate is pretty scary. But, that'll be her flash. Good job, Hecarim. Uh, I'm just going to run over here and go back to last hitting. I'm going to pick up... I'm going to pop one of my potions and just bop these some more. And boop. And it looks like she is healing up. She, I think she might have some mana regen on me. But that will be a minion for me. And it looks like Hecarim really wants to go again. And nope, it's not going to happen. I, th I think it might be warded. I don't know. But I do have my uh, playful trickster up, and I'm just n I'm just not going to use it at all because I know that if I do, that'll leave me very very vulnerable to ganks. And I thought I clicked to auto that. That was bad. Okay, but I'm going to pick up a second point in that. Oh, okay. And I need to dip out of here. And that's not going to kill me. I have my potions t my potion taking, but it looks like. He is going to pick up first blood. Good job, Hecarim. And I'm just going to stand over here for a minute. I'm going to auto that. I'm going to cue that. Do that. And get that one. And then I'm just going to head back to base. Uh, that'll be an early assist for me. Uh, and Kale do Kaylee does have a CS on me, but she is behind due to the fact that I killed her. And by going top, heck, you're getting pinched. Um, but I am going... What the? Whoa, I did not mean to zoom in. Okay, but I am going to pick up 
the components for my machine, because I do consider that a staple on Fizz, it, and it really is. Uh, you don't need to put points into your queue, really, until um, until last, because you can get your Lich Bane, and it's not a problem. But if you end up having, t like, if the enemy team's AD get really, really fed, you can swap it for a Lich Bane, not a Lich Bane. Uh, and an Iceborne Gauntlet instead, give you that little bit of extra armor, plus it gives you some AoE damage, and you don't have a whole lot of that. So, yeah, it's just overall really helpful. Um, but I am just going to sit here and last hit these minions, and I'm going to miss that one, because they had taken too much damage. I'm going to do that, and in a minute I can... Oh, I can do it now, probably, if I can just... Boop! I'm just going to... Oh! Okay, boop! And I probably should not have walked out there. But, I did do a lot of damage to her, so it could have been worse. And I'm going to pick up that minion with the dot from my W. And she's level 5. If I can get level 6 before her... Oh, you're just asking for it, aren't you? Boop! And I'm just going to walk out of there now. Because uh, that had put me pretty far overextended. I did not want to be in that position. So I'm just going to pop my last two potions. And I'm just going to farm it up a bit more. Um... But if I can hit level 6 before her, which I likely will, then I can really start... See, she isn't bullying me the way she should be. Uh, she's in a really good position to bully me, but she's not... Okay, there you go. That's what you're supposed to be doing. Um, but I'm going to just stay back a little bit. And boop. She is going to hit me with that. But... And that didn't kill her. Well, that's awkward. <laughs> but, that, yeah, that's really awkward. <laughs> but, if I can get a good Q off, and I need a barrier, and if she's not careful, I can just fly in on her right now because her ultimate is down, um, and kill her. So, I do need to make sure that I do have enough mana to pop my, t uh, my playful trickster again. She did use that, but it's not going to save her. And I just need to back on out of here. And I'm just going to head back to base, because if I stay by... Oh, oh she's spot. So I probably could have stayed, but... Vi probably could have killed me if she had not been bought. So, I don't know. That's just my train of thought here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pick up just an amplifying tone, just for the extra damage. I can put another point in my W. Uh, and I'm, I am going to be working on, I think I'm going to be working on a Leandris this game. Uh, because it really synergizes well with the passive and the active on Sea Stone Trident. Because it is a damage over time effect, and damage over time effects absolutely adore Leandris. So, um, I don't know where our mid laner is, so I'm just going to ping that she's missing. Drop a ward there, and I'm going to queue that just to make sure I get it. I'm going to auto that one once, and I'm going to auto that one. And Vi's going top, I think. On, I don't know what that was. Oh, oh, that was her... That was her what's-it. Her, uh... Yeah. I don't want to get that minion, because I know I'm going to tank, like, two tower shots for it, and that's not worth it. Um, I'm just going to ping that she's missing again. Yeah, I'm actually kind of surprised that she's still not back. Uh... But I think I'm just going to push it a little bit. And I'm going to... Oh, I'm not going to take a tower shot for that. Okay. Hi! Hi! Well, um... <laughs> I'm just going to walk over here and cue that. And I am going to take a tower shot for it, but... Could have been worse. Um, And I didn't pick up any potions. That was a mistake on my part. But she's still missing. Oh. I'm just going to pretend that I do not notice that Vi's here. Um, so that when she goes in, I can drop the shark on her. Uh, it looks like my ward just ran out, but she is running in there, so... It does make it a little bit easier for me to see that she's there. And I'm just gonna run through and queue her there. That'll be a lot of damage. And I'm just gonna... Bop there, do a bunch of damage to her again. Um, uh, she really just can't trade with me at the moment. Uh, because I actually have a kill and an assist and a lot of farm on her. So, I do need to be careful not to throw it, because if Kaylee shows up, Kaylee shows up again, um, 
sorry, I actually used to say kale all the time, so it feels weird. But, um, yeah, anyway, if she shows up, I'm, I'm just dead. Like, there, there's not really anything I can do about it, because they can bait me out with her ult, and I won't know that she's there. But I think that Vi might be going top, or she's in that bush waiting for me. So, she might just be waiting for me to push a little bit. And that's fine with me, because in the position that she's in, I can probably kill her. Oh, Kale's back, okay. I'm just going to do that, and hop on out of here. Because I know that if I stay, she has a righteous fairy up, and she's just going to bully me. But she is two levels behind me now, because she was back in base for so long. Uh, and that's, that's a huge advantage for me. Oh, and I'm just going to bop on out of here. And that'll be a little bit of damage, but not too big of a deal. I should have expected that, to be honest. But I did basically get a bunch of free damage off. And that's not a bad thing. But in fact, that's incredibly good. Um, but I'm just going to go ahead and farm these guys. And thanks to the passive from my Sea Stone Trident, it's not too difficult to farm with Fizz under tower. Um, and... Boop. Alright. That'll be... A max W for me, and she is level 6, so I can really kill her at any time if I really want to, uh, but I do want to wait until uh, I do have a good opportunity to do so, because she's, I, I need to be able to hit her with my W as well as my Q, so I need to not have to use it as a gap closer, and I want to be, and I want to be able to have it up when I leave, just in case, um, but Alas, that's not the way it's working. She's level 9, and it looks like she is not in a good position right now. So I'm just going to do that, and I'm going to barrier and flash. Because if I don't, I'm dead. Ooh, 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 oh, 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 whoa. She's a lot stronger than I thought she was. I should have taken into, into account the fact that she had her ult. She definitely should have had her ult left at that time. I should have realized that. But alas, I did not. So, um, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and pick up a Blasting Wand, and just a bunch of potions, because I'm a potion hog. <laughs> Sorry, let me try this again. I'm a, I'm a pot whore. Um, <laughs> but it looks like Vi is bottom, and Sivir knows it, but she's also just trying to bait it out. And it looks like Hefgrim's getting some lane farm, which is good for him, so that'll help him out a lot. Uh, but mid is missing. So I'm going to go ahead and ping that for my team, make sure that they know. She probably went back after pushing it, which wouldn't be a surprise to me. Um, it would be the smart thing to do. But I'm just going to queue that and make sure I get it. And go farm. And I'm actually not going to push it very hard. I'm just going to push it a little bit because I do want... No, what the hell are you doing? <sighs> Seriously? Seriously? Let Stop lagging, please. Thank you. Uh, but I, w I want her to miss out on CS, but I also don't want to push so far that I can't get out with my Playful Trickster. So, I'm not going to push it too incredibly hard. But, and it looks like she is pushing it back with her Righteous Fury again. Which is kind of what I expected her to do. But that's fine by me. I'm going to put another point in my Playful Trickster for the cooldown. And just wait. And her ult's probably still down. So, I can probably fight her right now. And she does not realize it. That's a dead kale. See ya. Boop. I knew that her ult's cooldown was down. Her ult was still on cooldown because it has a lot. It was quite a bit of a bigger cooldown than my ult, and I used mine earlier than hers, so I had to use that window of opportunity while I had it. And I'm gonna go ahead and pop some potions, and it looks like Vi is here, so I'm just going to. Q, and then just bop on out of here like that. That'll basically be some free damage for me. Um, but I do need to wait until my Playful Trickster is back up before I start going into last hit. And there it is. But, uh, oh, that she wasn't talking to me. Okay, whatever. Um, boop. Oh, okay. Boop. So I'm just going to go back to last hitting, because that's really what I need to do. Um, and I'm just going to pop some potions, just to make sure that I don't, um, die to me being low, and it looks like there's a fight erupting here, and I need to get in there, and, no I don't, and I need to back off, I need to, I really need to back off, 
Health pods, please. Health pods, please. Health pods, please. Health pods, please. Okay, I'm dead. Well, that could have been a lot worse. Uh, Kale busted her ult, so the next time I'm back in the lane, I'm just gonna kill her. Like, <laughs> she's just gonna die, and there's not really anything she can do about it. So, that's fine. Um, and, seriously, why does that keep happening? Okay, um, but Hecarim is going to get some lane farm here, and he is gonna get harassed quite a bit by the Kaylee. Um, but I'm gonna head into mid, um, again, of course, and get as much of the farm back as I can. Um, and she is still quite a bit behind me. She's 20 CS behind, plus she has 3 deaths and an assist, where I have 2 kills, a death, and an assist. So, I have a huge gold advantage on her right now. I do have my Lich Bane now, so my, um, my Q scales very, very well now. I can seriously just I, I can smash her in a minute here, if I do this right, and boop, okay. And now that she's here, and that'll be a kill. <laughs> the burst is immense when you get once you get your list, Lich Bane, as you may have just noticed. Um, but anyway, I miss. Oh, I thought that would kill it. Alas, I forgot I don't have a lot of AP yet. But that's just her sword sitting there. That's just her corpse. Um, don't know where Vi is right now, so I'm going to back off a bit. Uh, looks like... Oh, there she is. Hi! Hi! Oh, that hurts. Just a little bit. I'm going to get that minion. And I need to dip out a little bit, because I am staying up a bit further than I should be. Um... A lot of people think that Fizz is really just an overall counter for everything, but the truth of the matter, he isn't. It's all, uh, the way to play Fizz is you have to know when enemies' abilities are on cooldown and when they're off, and you have to seize opportunities. That's basically all you do is Fizz. And the more you do it, like the... Whoa. Oops. Lag, please. Uh, the more you do it, the better you get at it, and eventually you just become this, like, unkillable machine. Uh... Especially if you get a Zonius. Zonius is very, very strong on Fizz because it's another uh, moment of invulnerability. I'm just going to do that and bop on out. And it looks like Vi is here. And I'm just going to auto her once. That's fine with me. And boop. 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 And they probably think I'm alone here now. Um, I'm just going to pretend I'm really scared. Oh, Sivir's here. Okay. I'm just gonna do that, get the, all those farm. Boop! That's mine. Thank you. I don't know what she was doing up here, but. Well, she was up here. Um. And I'm just going to go ahead and do that. And bop on out. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay! Oh, I did not think that I did that much damage. But, that's alright. I'm just gonna do that. I didn't think I'd burst you th ugh, that hard. But anyway, uh, she's in. Lane's pushed. I'm going to go ahead and go back and pick up my haunting guys. And I'm going to go ahead and pick up a bunch of potions. If I'll stop lagging at the base, head back to lane. Um, and as you can see, um, yeah, I'm, I kind of feared something like that might have happened, but I was actually really, I really did want to get really good at Fizz, so putting myself in a stomp is actually helping me. <laughs> kind of makes me seem like a jerk, and I kind of am being a jerk here, but, uh, right now, my goal isn't to, uh, um, win the game as much as it is to, uh, uh, Oh, okay, sure. I think she knows I'm here. I'm just gonna... There you are. Oh my god, that was bad. And I need to back off. Gotcha. Oh, no I don't. I'm just gonna bury her right here. Sorry, I'm going quiet. Um, 
but she cannot fight me. Boop! That'll be a double kill for me, basically. Uh, I'm just gonna clear those minions, and back off. Um, I didn't think that the dot would still be on her when her ult stopped, um, but apparently it was, and that got me a kill that I was not expecting to get, and I didn't even have to pop my potions. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and pick up another Amplifying Tome, so that next back and get my, my Leandries, which will buff my dot incredibly. It'll mean that if I go in just one Q with my W on, that'll probably put them at about half health. Well, at least it will for Kaylee, because she's so... Excuse me! Because she's so incredibly far behind. Um, she's really just not in a good position to fight me right now. Um, like, she hasn't been for a while. L let's be honest here. But, I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Clear the minions. That probably wasn't the brightest of ideas, but... I felt the need to do it. And I'm just going to let her do that to me, because I really don't care at the moment. Um, I'm actually really just not scared of her. But in a moment, I will be able to go in and just bop the shit out of her. Um, so, yep, there she is. I'm just going to stay far up, because... Yeah, because if she comes up here to CS, she's going to take a lot of damage for it. Um... Oh, okay, sure. It looks like she is using that Righteous Fury to last hit, which is probably her best bet right now. And I'm just going to do that and walk out. Yeah, so anyway, as you just saw, my damage is just immense right now. Um, and there isn't really anything that she can do about it, because there's just so, I mean, there's so much damage. Um... I mean, just look at the dot damage just going right there. That 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 already is quite a bit. Um, so I'm just gonna push this a bit. I'm gonna drop a ward right there. And oh, okay, sure. I'm gonna back off. And it looks like uh, no, oh, no, that's by okay. I was thinking that someone might be uh, Shivana might be coming down from top to get me, but apparently not. I'm just going to throw that there, and that'll be a kill. I'm going to dodge the tower shot with that, farm those minions, and back off. Um, and I am, I'm not having a, I don't have a lot of health right now, but I'm not actually very concerned about it, because I do have my trickster up, and by that I mean I'm just going to use it to clear the wave anyway, so. <laughs> but, I'm just going to queue that, and... Do that for the Lich Bane proc and back out. I'm doing very, very well here in mid. I'm incredibly strong. And now that I'm getting my Leandries, that I'm I'm just gonna be bursting everything. So anyway, next I'm going to go ahead and start working on my Lich Bane. Not my Lich Bane, my wow, I'm calling everything Lich Bane for whatever reason. But I'm gonna be working on my Zonias next, because that'll give me two and a half seconds of invulnerability more than I already have. Um, so, and I think, let me test here. Okay, so that, that'll that put me at roughly 3 seconds and a, and 3.25 seconds, maybe, of invulnerability, which is actually quite a bit. I'm just going to clear those with my W, and keep on pushing, and I'm lagging. I'm lagging. Lag, please. Okay. But I am going to get that one. And I'm gonna get that one. And oh, come on! Wow, I'm lagging. But I am going to just clear all these minions best I can. Uh, Kaylee knows that she cannot fight me right now. I still haven't taken her tower, mostly because I'm having too much fun farming kills from her. Um, uh, and also it allows me to test how strong I can get. So it's not a bad thing. I'm just going to wait for her to start walking forward again. And there she goes. And I need to back out. I need to back out really hard right now. And I should I did not need to bury her there, but it made me feel safer, so I did it anyway. And I'm going to miss Nope, nope. Yeah, I'm going to miss that minion. Okay. But it looks like 3 of them are down are over here. So I'm going to ask for some assistance. And I know that I can kill Caitlyn. I I'm really just not worried about Caitlyn. As I'm about to demonstrate. Boop. And I'm gonna flash right here. 
and I'm dead. But I did do a hell of a lot of damage to them. Just okay. Do you have your? No, you don't have your ult anymore. Back off. Back off. Back off. Okay, no, bad. That 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 wasn't a very good idea for me. Um, to be honest, I thought I might be able to kill more of them, but I forgot my cooldowns are actually longer than I expect them to be. Uh, and I do need to. I do need to learn how to be a better Fizz player. I probably should have taken the tower a long time ago, I mean seriously, but I don't know, I just didn't feel like taking it. Um, that, that was a mistake on my part, I should have taken it. I do have half the kills on our team, and our Renekton and our Fiddlesticks are not doing too great. But our Super is getting pretty strong, so that's pretty good. Um, and it looks like our Fiddlestick is in trouble. Hopefully he's just gonna. Yep, he's just gonna fear her and keep walking. And yeah, that that wasn't very good, but he is okay now. Um, and I'm just gonna run in here and just fuck this kale to death. Okay, that sounds really gross. I'll be honest, but um. Anyway, as soon as she comes out to last hit minions, she is gonna be in a pickle. Um, so I'm just gonna be in here and I'm gonna farm. And as soon as she comes up, I'm just going to dunk her. Because that's basically what I'm in a position to do right now. And... Boop! And, for whatever reason, my Leandres isn't... I thought my Leandres applied on my Dawn. Okay, that's interesting. I thought I thought it... Um, I thought Leandres got proc'd on my Dot, but apparently it doesn't. And I'm just going to do that and bop out. Oh, okay. Oh, I missed that. I'm I'm bad, I'm bad, I'm bad, I'm bad. No, 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 no. Please, please. Surprise! Dodged! Haha! <laughs> oh, and she's gonna ult for me. But I did do a hell of a lot of damage to them. A lot more than I expected. And we need to group mid. Because if if we don't group mid, we're just gonna start feeding. I mean, I already just fed two kills in a row, so we, we need to group mid, uh, and I do need to finish my Zonias, because that'll make it a lot harder for them to kill me, and it's very important right now. I'm taking a lot of physical damage as well as magical, and it looks like a team fight's breaking out, Caitlyn getting ulted by, um, by Lulu and getting peeled for, but the Lulu is gonna go down, and the Vi will soon, most likely. Oh, nope. Hey. Well, that sucks. But they are gonna pick up a Vi, and that is an ace for them, and that sucks. But I'm going to go ahead, you know what, fuck it, I'm going to go ahead and pick up my Sorcerer's Shoes, so that next back I can pick up Home Guards, because they are pushing pretty hard. But like I said, we do need to group up, because that will be, I think that will be the deciding factor in this game, because we just lost two towers in a row, partially because of my own stupidity. And I should have dodged that, but I did not. Alas, I'm just going to step on the trap, just so I can get it out of the way. And I'm going to auto that, and that'll be a dead minion. Um, stick that there, just for some vision, and I'm just going to start clearing these minions out. Um, and I am doing very, very well um, overall. I'm just going to queue that, get the Lich Ring proc on that, and boop, and boop. I didn't get that one. Okay. But anyway, um, I'm about to hit level 16, which will put me... Yep, there we are. Which will put me very, very far ahead. Um, and... And, yeah, she's she cannot fight me at all right now. And if she comes too close... Oh, yeah. I'm just going to walk up here and pretend I'm taking the tower. And... And I'm just going to do that, and I'm going to barrier that, and that'll be a dead her. And I'm just going to queue there, get some distance, and I'm just going to do that for the slow. And she is going to do that to me, and I'm going to juke back through her, and she'll be dead for a blue buff. And I'm just going to bop out of here. And that really is what you want to be doing with Fizz. You want to be juking with your Q and your, uh, your E. <laughs> Lol, nope. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to pick up my home guards. And 
next back, I will be able to pick up my needlessly large rod, most likely. And someone needs to stop ship on us, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. She does not look like she has very much match resist. I mean, she's got some, but it's it's not enough to save her from the Fizzmeister. So I'm just going to do that, do a bunch of damage to her. She knows that I'm strong. She is scared, and that is good. Um, so I'm just going to... Please? Lag, please? But I'm just going to do that. And do that. That'll be some minions cleared. And it looks like I didn't get the Siegeman. That's alright. Uh, I'm going to go over here. And I'm going to do that. Get some movement. Um, I didn't get the XP. I think I got the XP for that. But in a moment, I will be able to hit level 17. Get the fourth point in my queue, which will make me very, very strong. So I'm just going to keep on pushing. Yep, th this next minion will get me to... Uh, 17. Uh, I'm just going to do that, clear those out, on, and we need to group up. Like, we really, really need to group up. Um, but I'm just going to do that, and that didn't work out, and ow, ow, okay, fine, go away. <laughs> I really just didn't want her to be there at that moment, because I fucked up my combo very hard. I meant, I meant to hit my Q and I hit my E, which was really bad because I need my E to get out. But, I do do a lot of damage here, and it looks like Vi doesn't really have any MR, like, at all. So I'm just going to do that, and that. Now if I can do this right, I'm just going to flash over here, and I'm going to do that. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm just going to... Oh, I'm not going to Q. I was hoping I'd Q so I could get the dot on her and that would finish her off, but it looks like it didn't. And that's, a, alas, that could be worse. Ragnarokton is pushing top very hard, and he did get the turret, and that'll get me my Needless, which is great. And, eh, yeah, he, he can't stop them anyway. Unless he's got home guards, and he doesn't, so... Th there's no that way that we can stop them from doing that, which is sad. Um... I've just been stupid and not been taking the tower. That That's what I should have been doing. But, alas, I was not. So, we paid the price and lost three towers and the inhib. That was me being very, very stupid. Um, and it looks like she's going up toward Baron, most likely. Um, well, actually, they might actually be doing it. We need, we need to go there right now. Because it looks like they are doing Baron, and if they are doing Baron, we are in a lot of trouble. Um, they know that we have our inhib down, but they do not know how fast we can get there. And if Sivir has her ult, she's not using it for whatever reason. Oh, they already got it. That's bad. That's very, very bad. But if I can stay right here, throw that word there, I might be able to get a pick off here, if I'm careful. Yep. I'm just going to do that throw that, and I'm going to do, oh boy, I'm just going to barrier, do a bunch of damage to her, that was bad, um, I should not have used my trickster to get over that wall, because that let me in, put me in a very vulnerable situation, and there's a good chance that that could cost us the game right there, um, so I've, I've been messing up a lot, Renekton has been pushing a lot, so he's got a lot of farm, but he has been feeding too, so he's not extraordinarily strong. And they're they're getting very tanky. There isn't much that I can do to them at this point. So I think this will be the game. Yeah, this is the game. So I'm just going to toss out the GG. And that was Fizz and Mid. And you'll see me next time. Waiters.